Members of Somalia Security Services are undergoing an extensive six-day training at the Banadir Joint Operations Center in order to be equipped with specialist skills needed to secure the country's ongoing national elections. Drawn from the Somalia Police Force, the National Intelligence Agency, and the Somalia National Army, the 45 officers will receive training in forensic investigations and intelligence-led policing. Speaking at the start of the training in Mogadishu, the African Union Mission in Somalia, Amisom Police Commissioner, Assistant Inspector General of Police, Augustine Magnus Kelly, said Amisom, SPF and other international partners are working together through the Joint Operations Center to safeguard the security, integrity and credibility of the electoral process. In line with these international best practices of intelligence-led policing geared towards the improvement of the integrity of election processes, the need for analysis of information, coordination of intelligence prompted this establishment of the joint operations centers. The Assistant Inspector General of Police added that the Joint Operations Center were established in line with international best practices of intelligence-led policing, especially securing the integrity of the election process and the need for coordination in planning and intelligence analysis. One notable achievement of the Joint Operations Center has been the establishment of a women's situation desk at the various centers across the country in order to protect women and other citizens against all forms of election-related violence. The Director General of the Ministry of Interior and Federal Affairs, Yusuf Ali Mohammed, said it was with the support of AMISOM that Somalia managed to establish 12 joint operation centers across the country. The joint operations centers work in coordination with the National Election Security Tax Force, which is the highest security organ taxed with securing Somalia's ongoing national elections. The tax force is chaired by the Somalia Police Force with support from Amazon Police. Kamil Sadiq, CBA TV.